everybody, and welcome to episode 3 of my Techtopia Let's Play. And today, we're going to do a little bit of stuff. First off, we want to get one of these um, people here going as our chef. And in order to do that, we're going to need some emeralds. I've been selling some stuff and stocking some stuff up. So, we're going to get a kitchen and a chef online today. And that's the tavern. I don't need that. I need the one that looks like a cake. Where are you? Right there. Okay, 21. And we're lacking two emeralds to being able to get two chefs. I don't want the blacksmith. I don't want the rancher. Whoops. And, oh, cool, okay. Let's see if we can sell anything to the dude man over here. And, potatoes we get one emerald for, it's not really worth it. Oh, okay, that's good. So we're going to save the potatoes. Wait, who are you? What are you? You are a butcher. And who are you? Oh, perfect. Come here, right? You. Okay. Awesome. And we want to get... We want to get the tradesman. We'll get one more. Before the price goes up, that'll save us... Ooh. One emerald. Price already went up. So, there's this guy over here, and, yeah, he's fine. We have one really good chef. Okay, so you, you're going to, I'm going to take off the golden apples, golden carrots for now. Okay. Now, we also need to get in here. I'm not sure if I need those. We also got a villager heart, and those are how you get children. And when you get further into the game, it'll be how you get more villagers. So this is the building that I built. Okay, down here is kitchen. I want to put a couple things in here. But until then, we're going to put the kitchen token there. And th it even has awnings. So that's where the kitchen is going to be. This guy can smelt charcoal. Are you the good chef? No, you're not the good chef. You're the good chef. I'm also going to take off golden apples and golden carrots for those. So, you can make everything else but that. Don't don't use up the gold. Well, there's no gold there anyhow. But when there is gold, don't use it. This is another house. And they immediately claimed it, which is nice. That is exactly what we wanted to do. So now that we have that going, we have, um, I want to say lumber yard. But what is that? Oh, tree farm. Tree farm. Man, I'm telling you. So we didn't need the item frames as of yet. But we will need them. We will use them. We have one little emerald left. So now the merchant should want to buy some other stuff. And we don't have anything. We have a little bit of cooked mutton. So, that is that. And I'm going to go look at our villagers here. I noticed our villagers are all ladies, which is fine. We don't want you to gather sugar cane, carrots, wheats, or potatoes. Carrot, wheat, or potatoes. We don't want you to do that. You, same thing. or potatoes. 
values. You can. We don't want you to gather sugar cane either. We're going to leave you on carrots. I'm going to go through and do this to a couple of our villagers, or all of our farmers. Okay. We want you to do carrots and not the other stuff. Okay, that's good. So yeah, we're going to do a little bit of um, management. You can gather sugar cane and wheat. We need one more farmer for wheat. Okay, you're the beetroot. Okay. You can gather sugar cane and wheat and wheat. Okay. You're good. You're good. You're good. And you're good. Where are my other farmers? Your lumberjack. I might have to change a couple people. Oh yeah, I only have six. I need at least one person for potatoes. Lumberjacks are coming in, going to bed. Let's see, you are what? Wheat? Okay. You are beetroot. I'm going to take beetroot off of you and put you on potatoes. So I think I did two people for beetroot. Wheat. Potato. Wheat. Oh. You can do... You do wheat and potatoes, okay. That's fine. Yeah, that's fine. I'm just going to hop into this bed right here. So We need our people to be happy. So we're going to need to start not skipping the night here soon. But for the time being, I've lost too many villagers. And yeah, I'm going to skip the nights. And there's something in here I wanted to do. Okay. Uh, let's see. Okay, there we go. Now our farmers are going to be getting back to work. They're going to be going doing carrots. That's good. So next, we're going to plan out where we want to put some more stuff. So we have our farmers going on here. And they're doing good. They're depressed as all get out, but it's all good. So next thing we want to save up for is we need more space for more people. So I said farms are going to be going this way. Industrial stuff like that is going to be going this way. And this counts as industry because they're doing something. Yes, they have a uh, quote-unquote apartment upstairs, which is fine. That's good. We can do that. We can allow them to do that. And I want to pick this up because I was using that to make some stuff to build. I don't want that left there. Okay, that is fine. And we have a merchant coming in, which is good. 
So now we need to decide which way we're going to go with some more stuff. And I think the next thing we're going to do is a house. Just for housing sake. And I want to build it so it has two, has double four people homes. So a total of eight. Kind of like the upstairs there. So we're going to do something like that. And we're going to get some stuff so we can start planning that out. What do I have in here? I have a bunch of stuff left over from building this house. So I'm going to go with a similar style with, you know, terracotta for the main part and I'll plan it out and I'll probably put it like right in here. It'll probably be one apartment downstairs, one apartment upstairs, and it'll have a little staircase. So, but let's get some uh, dirt and I need to fill in a spot and I'm gonna get some cobble just to kind of outline the place and I'll probably work on that between episodes but we will what do I want to get? dirt okay I have a bit That's good. Now, I want to level off one spot. I'm not going to make everything flat. I'm going to do some height variation. But the one thing I wanted to do was right in here. I wanted to come back this way a bit. Like that. And I want to fill this in. So let's fill that in real quick. A little bit of terraforming on on camera. And we'll get this filled in. All right, there. That is good. So I wanted to do that because I wanted to bring this path here out around to connect here. Whoops. So people have nice, even paths to follow. Alright, that is good. And I will put one of these that I pulled up right in here until we can figure out what we're going to do here. And the other ones, I'm going to come up this way a bit. Put one up here, and one up here. Okay, so that's where that's going to be. So for a four-person home, villagers need 12 um, blocks each, or they will start becoming overcrowded. And we don't want our villagers to feel overcrowded. There we go. And I'll do that here too. I did a bit of terraforming over that. So there we go. Now that'll come up like that. Okay. So we need 48 internal blocks. So I want to start the house here. Six, seven, eight, nine, 11, 12, 13. 
13, okay, that's a good number. And four, five, six, seven. And there, the house will be about this size. And we'll give it a stairway right here so I can fill this part in. Like that. And I'll probably fill this part in here as well. Don't really need this dip right here. because I can put another house right over this spot when we get a chance. We'll just use up what, what, what better dirt we have here. And that was perfect. So that will bring that out here. I'll put this torch here. So kind of fill in Let's put it right here. Okay. Okay, so this is where this is going to go. And it's going to have a two wide staircase and come up like this. And the staircase will actually probably start like here and then go up like this. So that's what that's going to do. And it's going to have like a false foundation. So there's going to be that part of it will probably be cobble like that. So or whatever I decide to use for the foundation blocks. So that is what that is. Now we're going to have to go and see how many emeralds we're going to need for our, to get both of those four people homes. And that's the architect. That's right. So we're going to need 18 and 18 is 36. We're going to need 36 emeralds. That sounds like quite a lot. And it might even be quite a lot, seeing as how potatoes are now selling for one emerald. So I'm going to have to sell other stuff in order to um, do that and all the potatoes are gone. So, oh, we have another bit of carrots that we can sell when the time comes and the cooks are making baked potatoes and bread. So, the chefs are the chefs, yeah, not the cooks, the chefs. But, and they're also making charcoal. So, that is at least a good start. We're not gonna have many potatoes, if any, to sell for quite a while. So in between episodes, I will work on getting this house built and getting... I want to get a spruce farm, spruce tree farm section going as well so we can have uh, the different types of wood. And spruce is the one we're missing. And as you can see, there's plenty of spruce trees around. I don't know why lumberjacks haven't chopped any down. But they haven't, so that is what that is. So I will help them out and get them a section made up for Spruce Tree Farm. And we're getting quite a bit of lag here at the moment. So I will sign off for now. And we will see you in the next episode. Have a good one. Bye-bye.